I'll tell you what, we're up in the hills there. Look at this amazing view of Los Angeles. It is beautiful. Um, you can see the skyline there. And uh, I'll tell you what, man, this is, we're having a great time here in LA. Listen, um, don't forget the game's on tonight. Arsenal versus Bayern Munich. The only place you can watch that game is on Premier Sports. Um, there's a link in the description. Uh, subscribe to them as well if you want to watch that game. It's the only place where you can watch that friendly today, Arsenal versus Bayern Munich. And we were driving up here and we've been having a little debate as we have been doing everywhere we go on different, different subjects. A lot of times the, the debate gets heated up, right? And then I was just thinking to myself, let's put it out there to all the gooners out there and see what they think. I've got my man Harps here. Come on, Robbie, right? Harps is over here. He's made the trip for the game. Troops, as you know, has made the trips for the game. And he's been tripping a lot. I'm not even going to get into that, right? Who but... tripped, blood? <laughs> <laughs> the debate that we've all been talking about in the car as we've been driving, and we've been, we've been going on about this for days, right? We all know that one person who's not here at the moment is Koscielny. Koscielny is not here, he's the captain. As far as I know, they haven't stripped him of the captaincy yet. And uh, what we wanted to find out is who should be the captain? Who should be Arsenal's captain? Because definitely shouldn't be Koscielny, he should get stripped. So who should be Arsenal's next captain? Harps, who do you reckon? <coughs> Arsenal captain next season. We should go for Torreira, I think. Torreira? Torreira. He's only just come. That guy, he's an engine. He's, he's been starting these games in the Premier League last season when we've been going away from home, when we've been taking these L's. He's the only guy in that team, I could say, that put in the shift in most of the games. All right. All right, Torreira. I vice mean... captain, I would go with, with um, Lacazette. Yeah. As a vice captain, number two. Um, I think that guy as well, he's that leader. He gets that goal when we need it the most in the least crucial time. At least by example. Yeah, yeah, that's it. Yeah. So All right. I think these are the two options we should go oh, with. So Torreira, you're going. So we just stick to captain. You're going Torreira. Torreira. He needs to play every game, Robbie. All right. Who are you going for? Like a blood clot, Zet. Man, man, come on, man. <laughs> like a Zet. Yeah, he's only one blood. See, is he? I mean, vocal enough? Is he that? You see him on the pitch. He got a leadership blood. quality. You see him on the pitch. Of course, he's vocal enough, blood. You understand? He leads by example as well. You get me? It's a good shout. It's a good shout. It's the best shout, blood. All right, all right. off camera as well, blood. What are you telling me? You That's the debate. We're right, so now here's my one, right? And yeah. this is what's been causing a lot of controversy today. Yeah, you are an idiot. <laughs> now listen, if, it, if we go by players that start every single week, and listen, he does this player. He starts every single week. I don't know why. Xhaka. Xhaka's going to be here. Right? We're not selling him, are we? And don't get me wrong, I'm always a person that says, boy, on the ball, he's too sloppy and that. But the one thing about him that I have noticed in, in, in games that we play, he does have a bit of leadership quality. He has a bit about him. He's one of the few players you see, you know, getting into other players. He always comes over and, you know, even if he's had a terrible game, innit, he'll still come over. He never hides from the fans. He doesn't really hide in games. And I do think... I don't know, man. No, Robbie. Did. I think if if I was to give it to anyone right now, and Lacazette's a good shout, but I think I'd probably have to go Xhaka because he plays every single game and does have leadership qualities, and maybe it might make him better. That responsibility that he has on his yeah, shoulders. But he's captain for Switzerland. Does that make him and better? And no, I was, it don't, so I was like... about to get to that. He's captain of Switzerland and he does do pretty well for Switzerland. Yeah, well, it shouldn't take an armband to make you fucking play good for our club. But sometimes players step up when they get the armband. No, nah, You've really. seen in the past players with poor discipline. I want you right? to step up without an armband. I want you to step up on a regular basis. Well, Lacazette but... steps up without a armband. Simple. Fact. He does, but is he a captain though? Yeah, he is, bloody. He's a leader. All right. Everyone likes him in the club. He's a fan favourite. He's someone that if the fans see him stepping out leading the team, you're not going to complain. If Shaka leads out the team, man are going to complain, like me. <laughs> All right, listen, I'm going to put it out there to everybody. What do you think? Who should be the captain? Helen's there. Actually, we didn't get Helen in. Come. I see you put your hand up. She's coming in with a last minute, a last minute person. Who are you going, Helen? Socrates. So, mm, yeah. That got nothing to do with the fact that he's Greek, right? Maybe a little <laughs> bit, but also because he's a defender. Yeah. He's a leader. He goes out there and he fights for the team in every game. Whether he even messes up and does some dodgy tackles here and there, 
but he gives it his all. And Socrates it reminds me shot. of Tony That's Adams. Back to basics, lead from the back. That's all right. just my opinion. That's not, you know, she's kind of coming. That's a Sorry, good shot. I, Better than I yours, blood. Personally, I love Lacazette. I yeah. think he's great. I think he's got all the right attributes as a leader. But from the front, can he command the back? Our problem is at the back. We need leaders at the back, sorting out that back line and mm. locking them in and playing correct. That's a good shout. So listen, you've got four names there. You've got Lacazette, Xhaka, Socrates and Torreira. Um, who do you think? You might think somebody else. There's a lot of people last night when we were debating it with some of the American guys saying Bellerin as well. So who do you guys think? Um, let us know. Um, put in the, uh, in the description who you think we should go for. And also, don't forget, if you're not here in LA and can't get to the game, only place you can watch the game tonight is on Premier Sports. Arsenal versus Bayern Munich, and it won't be 5-1.